Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Today's video is just a weekend vlog where you guys are going to spend some time with me shopping and doing anything else that I needed to get done over the weekend. First we started off in Walmart and let me just tell y'all what happened in Walmart. Has to stay in Walmart y'all because I just can't get right. So while we were in Walmart, I did pick up two of the Miss Myers scents for $4.88. Um, I do like to pick up Miss Myers as I see them because of like the seasonal selection of scents and I do like to give those a try. Surprisingly. Lily was just saying I didn't have anything in my cart yet. What to do? Two things about it. These are all in the for 2030. So from Blue Line, I did um, pick up a couple of things, but this is my Walmart haul. So I got the Fiji Apple Fruit Crisp, um, just the dried apples, some great value gummies, as well as some sweetened banana chips from Target. So this is just a Target and Walmart haul. I got the Confetti Cake Chips Ahoy. These are chewy. They are really good. They're new. And I did get the... Um, 12 pack of the mini Oreos, the Nutter Butters, and the Chips Ahoy. Found some s'more Oreos um, and along with some Java Chip flavored cream ones. So I hope that my son likes those since he likes the Java Chip Starbucks Cappuccino. Also some strawberry mango sparkling water. Just something for me to have for work for the week. Along with two bags of the Buttermilk Ranch Rice Cakes, those are my favorite. Not so sour punch sweet bites. This is just something Sky Stephen picked up, and I agreed to it because one of them said cotton candy. 
So I also got the sweet and dried mangoes um, because these are now one of my favorites, the freeze dried strawberry slices. I did pick up two of the mangoes just because they were a good size to pick up. As I said before in the previous clips, um, I didn't have anything in my basket at Target until I picked these up. These were about $3.50 each. I needed those and I picked up some non-scratch um, sponges so that I can clean my oven along with a mask, some juicy fruit, Swedish fish, um, some Funnables fruit snacks and strawberry flavor. I am going to be doing an end of the year teacher gift. So that is the reason why I picked up the Juicy Fruit and the Sweetest Fish and we want to try the new Little Mermaid cereal. I also picked up some salt and vinegar Pringles, which are my favorite, along with the peach air freshener that was on sale for $2.30. I'm always looking for air freshener. Uh, we, got, we got the Easy Off just because I'm tired of using the dollar store time where it leaves a lot of fumes. And of course, shout out to Jenna Unfiltered for actually making me try these drinks. I'm like so seeing them in her video and I really want to try them. So I got grape, watermelon, and of course my favorite, the Fiji um, apple pear. And so this is my favorite lotion to use. It is the coconut and manoi oil, along with some color changing tumblers. Um, I'm gonna put these in the gift for the end of the year, along with the Dr. Teal's um, sugar scrub and then a ice mold some dust and clean fast spray just because a lot of things could be dusted around here I also got two cans of the small dog wet dog food um, and then I picked up the lemonade Miss Myers hand soap along with this one that I'm not even gonna try to make a fool out of myself and pronounce I just know that I did smell both of them before I bought them I also got the off-brand of Zyrtec for kids as well as some soothing cough drops strep throat is going around where we are at and I'm sure it's going around where you're at as well but we are just trying so hard not to get sick and of course I picked up the fit sips um, by circle because they are my favorite I also picked up the premier protein um, these are $8.99 as well as just some cotton candy mini cupcakes got the green grapes and I got the um, three trio of the uh, peppers and then some all just gravy and I picked up um, just some sun-dried tomato basil wraps I do hope to make some sandwiches this week along with some strawberries um, and then I picked up the um, duo of the mixed berries and two large cartons of eggs as well as um, some red grapes I do want to try to make some cracked grapes with that and on manager special at Food Lion, I did end up getting the fresh chicken wings. So once I got these, I did wash them off and just put them into a bag. My chicken tenderloins, um, I bought and I washed those off and put those into a Ziploc bag overnight and then fried them the next day for my meal prep for the week. I also got two um, packages of the chicken uh, wingettes and then some watermelon, some ground turkey, um, some coffee pods just because we have ran out and some chocolate vanilla pudding snacks. I really feel like that off brand is, mm -hmm. I got the signature brand of the Olive Garden Italian dressing. I'm gonna try to make like a crock pot chicken dish with that. I got the chicken broth, the almond milk, two of the onion um, mixed dip. So they were 79 cents. I said, why not go ahead and stock up? Got the Hawaiian punch um, with surfing strawberry citrus. And then I also picked up a white one that is white water wave. And then I picked up the blue one, which is like um, blue typhoon. And then of course there's my milk, my gold milk that needs to go in the refrigerator this time and not get spilled as well as some onions. And I picked up a um, boba milk tea case for my phone. Um, as well as a water bottle that I can decorate myself. It is um, a really great water bottle. And then of course I picked this up from Target. It is the um, plastic like gallon jar or whatever. That's what I'm gonna put my daughter's teacher's gift in as well as some pop rocks because I want to make the cracked grapes. I got a slimmer belt because I do want to start working out and getting myself like back together. Um, and then I picked up the Freeman's Fabulous Foot Pamper Spa Kit. It really looks cool. Like I said, for $5, you can't beat it. Treat yourself, do what you need to do. 
Cam picked out some socks. Um, and then I, we got the Oreo packs. These are my favorite. And then I picked out some new um, chapstick. You can never go wrong with too many chapsticks. Soda can candies, as well as a funnel cake pitcher and mix. And then last but not least, I think in this bag, um, I did pick up something for Sky. It's just like a bear with um, a bunch of little candies in it and um, just some incense. They are three, four dollar here at Five Below and we can't go wrong with that. I also got the Julian Michaels kettlebell. This is just a five pound, something that I could easily work out with. Um, and then um, I also got the glass dispenser jar. So I want to say this was my Mother's Day gift from um, my mother's husband. Just some nice pretty little yellow flowers. So hopefully I'll keep them alive this time y'all. I'm not really good with keeping plants alive. So thank you for those. Basically I'm just talking about how it's Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all of you all. I know that this video is coming out late but I did have to get finals um, done. So like my final exam done in my class. And so I'm just like waking up Mother's Day morning, not really feeling well. So the first thing I ate was just some macaroni salad made by my grandmother with some apple juice. Um, I wanted to say shout out to Jenna Unfiltered for putting me onto these drinks as I'm gonna try one this morning. And I think I tried the um, watermelon one this morning. So. Y'all be sure to go check out her channel. It will be linked in my description box down below. All right, so I got three baskets of laundry to do. That's what I'm getting into right now. Use the one cup for everything. So four cups of sugar. Consistency is coming together. I just grinded up some nerd clusters, pop rocks, um, some candy fun dip, and dum dums. And I made this. So, this is what they'll be dipped in. These are from the nerd clusters. I don't know, they're not going to go on the candy grapes. I just set them to the side so Sky can eat them. So, this definitely needs to come to a boil. As you guys can see, I think that it is starting to. Form. I just want to make sure it comes to a boil first. So this is what I want to do for myself for Mother's Day. Make some candy grapes the right way, y'all. I've been trying to master this since I first seen them on YouTube and or TikTok. And I haven't gotten it right since, but I think I finally got it. Oh no. I tried everything coming up more. So these are some really great flavors that you guys can add to your um your candy grapes, candy pickles, whatever you want to add. So I have quite a few. I think I'm going to choose to do um, cotton candy if I can find it. I found it. You literally just can add in like a little bit and then um, stir it up. It'll give it that cotton candy smell. I can smell it now. I'm also going to add in some of the icing color. Um, along with the white um, icing. Yeah, this is the white icing color. I got this off of Amazon and it's supposed to help um, with the color. So, just gonna add in a little bit. Alright, 
let's go ahead and get ready to dip white. So I'm just gonna show you guys that you just go in and dip it. Let it drain off. And then basically just roll it around in this and let it sit. Okay, so I made some Dutch's potatoes, which is just simply using potatoes, um, salt, butter, and pepper. These are the Old Bay ones. Happy, happy Monday, y'all. Making my lunch, getting my breakfast together. I had extra time. 